Welcome back to the channel guys, welcome back to the another video. In today's video, I'm going to talk about iOS 18.3.1 running on one of the oldest iOS 18 supported device that is iPhone 10s, as you can see over here. Now this device is running all new latest iOS 18.3.1. Let me show you that into the about section 18.3.1 as you can see over here. So in this video, I want to talk about the battery life and also about the performance. I will be sharing Geekbest score. So I want to talk about that how battery is performing from last couple of days since I'm using it. So without any further ado, let's get up into this video. Also, for some reason, this uh, widget of Spotify is not working here. I'm not sure why it is not working, but for some reason it is not working as you can see. Now, without any further delay, let's get jump into the battery. So I will go to the settings battery section over here. Let the battery stats load. First thing first, we will see the battery draining chart. So this is the battery draining. Now over here, battery draining chart. Now you can see this straight line over here. Now this is the time when I was sleeping, but the device was really different sort of things in the background. But still there is no drop. There is like 1-2% drop over here, but there is no big drop, which means battery draining is pretty much fixed over here and it is running really, really fine. If you guys are facing battery draining, let me know in the comment section below. Now I want to talk about how the battery performed over here. So over here, this is the first day when I was using iOS 18.3.1. As you can see, I used almost 100% of my device and it got 6 hours and 16 minutes, 6 hours screen on time. For this much old device, this is insane. I used TabMad. I was watching Cricket Game, the threads and some other applications as you can see. I also use YouTube and Instagram for a bit along with the WhatsApp. But this is amazing screen on time. I want to show you the battery health because many of you asked me that too. 85% battery health and the screen on time is amazing. I'm also using network. Keep that in your mind. The next day I used almost 50% of my device and I got 2 hours 11 minutes screen on time because I was not that active. And this time I was also using camera for a bit. But if the, I average this out, I'm still getting more than 4 hours of screen on time, which is insane. So in terms of battery life, 18.3.1 is a really, really great update. And pretty much a lot of things have been fixed over here, as you can see. Now it's time to talk about the Geekbench score because that matters a lot for so many of you people. So I will go to the Geekbench app, CPU benchmark, CPU history. Now, as you can see, this is 18.3.1. I ran the benchmark right after installing the update. I got 1285 or a single core, 2335 or a multi core. Now, if I compare this one with the average one, it is lower than the average. Multi core is also lower than the average. Now, these scores are not good. This is a really, really bad score. So I was actually worried. So after using the device for a couple of hours, I ran the test again. And this time I got way much improved score. 1312 or a single core, 3038 or a multi-core. Now single core is higher than the average one. And multi-core is also way higher than the average one, which is a really, really good sign. So on paper, things are looking really, really good. In fact, this is a really old device. Still, I'm not facing any sort of lag or something. Everything is working really, really fine. In my lot of previous videos, I talk about that how the um, touch response issue is going on. So if I show you the touch response over here, touch response issue is also solved. So let me do something like this just to show you. And as you can see, no issue over here. Before this, if you uh, remember my video, I was tapping over here and it was not working. So yeah, things are way better in the 88.3.1, which is a really, really good sign. Well, this is all from this video. If you like this video, let me know in the comment section below. If you are facing any problem, let me know in the comment section below. Yes, I am getting quest, um, comments regarding battery draining. I will be making a video about that very, very soon. And I will see you in the next video. Until then, take care. Peace out.